Hi, my amazing pen friends. It's Jess from Disney Jess. And we have a few pins to open here. So I have one older pin pack. This is the Best Friends pack. It came out in 2012. We'll go over that one in a minute. And then I have two of these Magical Mystery newer packs. Now these are the Series 21, which depicts different characters, ales and mailboxes. These are open edition. They're about $8 in the park. You get one pin per pack and they have some cute designs. Some of the other ones that they've done, they've done like lunch boxes, they've done thermoses, hats. Um, they did a whole series of Tinkerbell, eye masks, car, like different characters, cars, um, just a lot of different things. So they're really kind of a fun set and they're usually only about six pence. So it's pretty easy to get all of them. This particular set, like I said, is mailboxes, which I think is a cute concept and I really like it. So the options we have in the six pin set is we have a Bambi mailbox, which has this really cute brown, you have the butterfly kind of symbolizing that scene where the butterfly lands on Bambi's nose. I think it's really cute. And then you have like the forest on the front of the mailbox. Next we have a bigger type mailbox, like the type you would see on the corner where you like a Dropbox mailbox. And this one is, I'm pretty sure Timothy Mouse, because you have the kind of button motif of his outfit there, and you also have the little feather there. So I'm pretty sure that's what that one is. Then we have a very obvious snowman mailbox, which I think is adorable. And this one I'm pretty sure is Olaf. Then we have a, you know, the type of mailbox that you might have hanging on the side of your house. And this one has tentacles and the little shell there. So I'm pretty sure this one is Ursula. Next, we have a blue mailbox that says mail on the front there with that little tag and the little bow there. So I'm guessing this one is Donald. Our last one is a wooden mailbox, which is very important for the character it is. And it's in this red and kind of red and yellow motif and you have a little red feather there so I'm pretty sure that one is Pinocchio. So out of all of these the two that I want most <laughs> since I have two packs are Olaf and Ursula because those will both fit into collections I already have although this might be a collection that I try to get all of the pins for because they usually stick around in the parks for quite a while. A lot of people have them as traders because they're a nice, easy, you know, cheap, cheap, we'll put that in quotes, trader at $8. So let's go ahead and open this up and see what we get. Ursula, oh, they're bigger than I thought they were. Oh, Ursula, you've got some mail, girl. So there is a little scuff here, but other than that, she's in really good condition. I love the mail, although is it just me or is it mirrored weirdly? Like it looks like it should be going, like the letters should be going the other way, which is a little weird. I mean, I would think, like all the letters are in the right order. They just look off to me. Am I the only one? Let me know what you guys think. Maybe it looks better through the camera because of the mirror. I don't know. But I do like the details with the tentacles and the shell. I think it's a really cute pen. And it's going to be a great addition to my Little Mermaid collection if I don't get all of these pens. Next. Let's see who we got here. we have Pinocchio. Oh, he's super cute. I love all the detail they've given. So it says letters instead of mail because it's an older movie. I think that's very appropriate. And just the feathers and the way that they've done the wood on the sides and everything looks really cool. So yeah, I think I might try and get a couple more packs of this and see if we can complete the collection or trade for some. I think that would be really cool. So we'll set those off to the side. And next we're going to talk about this pen set. So this is a pen set that originally came out in 20, 2012. And it has 16 different possibilities. In these bigger packs, you do get more pens. So you have five different pens in here. 
It retailed for $30. Now, I'm pretty sure there are more now in the parks than $30, but this is quite an old set. There are 16 different designs. And since I already have opened, like when they originally came out, I opened these. And so I've had these around for forever and not really done anything with them. <laughs> They've just kind of been there. So I figured I would get another pack. I'm missing five and there are five in here. The chances I'll get all five are, I would say pretty slim. But I thought it would be nice to kind of go over the ones that I have along with the ones that I'm missing. So I've kind of put them out in the same order as they are in the back of the, the package here. So I am missing the Lilo and Stitch and the Mike, uh, Mike Wazowski and Sully one. But I do have Woody and Buzz. And these are really cute pens and they do all have two pin posts. Um, like I said, they're quite old. This one has some smuts on the back. Um, I probably, these are, I think the first pin pack that I ever opened, like the big pin packs. Then we have a trio here. Most of these are duos, but we do have a couple of trios here. So we have Pumbaa and Timon and um, Simba down here really cute i love the the circle and everything these were just yeah really nice pens next we have bambi and flower just kind of skidding across the ice i've always thought this one was particularly cute we have ariel and flounder here because they're best friends all of these are supposed to be best friends by the way in case i didn't say that then we have Mowgli and Blue from The Jungle Book, which is a really cute, him giving them a nice hug. I am missing the next one, which would be Todd and Copper. So we'll try and get it to focus there. So there's Todd and Copper. So we're hoping to get that one. Next, we have Huey, Dewey and Louie and this cute green circle. Next is Pinocchio and Jimmy Cricket. Really sweet. We have Pooh and Piglet there. That's a very sweet moment. And then we have Aladdin and Genie. In our next row, we have Mickey and Pluto, definitely best friends. And then we have Dodger and Oliver here. And that, oops. <laughs> and that is the, all the ones that I have. Now I'm missing the last two here in the set, which would be Mulan and Mushu right over here. Let's see if I can get it to focus a little bit. And then I'm also missing Lock, Shock and Barrel. So we'll see which ones we can get maybe we can complete it maybe we can't if i can just get a little bit closer i think that would make me happy so and i have had this pack for quite some time i'm not exactly sure a couple of years at least this is now a retired set but you can still find sealed packs around there and they're usually not too expensive so oh our first one is Pooh and piglet that's okay. They're cute. Lots of people collect Pooh and Piglet. Okay. Next we have <laughs> Mickey and Pluto. Another duplicate. But the chances are pretty slim when you get to this point to be able to pull a new one. Bambi and Flower. Okay. Just one new one. Come on. Oh, Todd and Copper. Yay! That's what gets me one closer. So we'll put Todd and Copper where they need to go here. I do like that these have two pin posts. I, I think if they were made now, they would probably only have one. But the two make them so secure when you put them on things. So I think I have one more in here. Yes. So Mike and Sully. So we got two closer. That's, that's something. And I don't think it's focusing very well on them, is it? Sorry guys. Oh, there it goes. Now Sully does, or no, it's Mike has a little, oh, maybe it was just a little smut. There was a little something on his eye, <laughs> but super cute. So we will put them next to 
Woody and Buzz here, which means I now am only missing three. Much better. So, and I have three traders. We'll see if we can find somebody who has them or maybe I can purchase them because they're probably not too expensive. I would expect them to be under $15 because they were pretty common pens. So anyhow, that's all I have for today. And until next time, I'll see you guys real soon.